What's up, everybody? It's another beautiful day at Universal Studios. And you know what that means. Halloween Horror Nights. Let's go check it out. So if you look really closely down over there where the saw maze used to be, they're starting to put some detail on that house facade, which is really nice. Can't really see anything over here behind the uh, big metro set wall. But, yeah, if you look really closely, they're starting to put some detailing on that house over there. So that's really cool. Uh, twice in a row now that the tram is not going towards the metro set mazes. Dang, that sucks. Well, maybe next week. Let's go take a look at Trick or Treat then. I just photobombed like 15 people, by the way. And as you can see on the sides of the tent, they've put up some black tarp to block out uh, some of the light. And also in that back half, uh, you can see they've started to put on the ceiling. So it's going to be harder and harder every week to see the interior of this uh, maze once they start putting more detail inside. They have some really cool stuff in here in the Studio Central store. They updated a couple of the t-shirts here too. I actually really like those mugs, those are pretty cool. They got some cool stuff sometimes, other times it's like a hit or miss, but today was pretty good. So you can tell they've added some more detail, especially like right here on the corners, so that looks really nice. It looks better and better every week that I come and check it out. Looking pretty good. Beautiful sounds of construction. Love it. On a side note, was anyone else kind of disappointed that they didn't announce a maze at Midsummer Scream? I was kind of hoping they would, but it's alright, I guess. Nothing really new there. It's a big facade, though, so. It's gonna be interesting to see what it ends up being. There's a lot of rumors online, but I always wait till they officially announce things. Let's go inside the Universal Studios store because it's hot. So yeah, it's gonna be interesting to see what that facade ends up being. So I'm excited. It's a really big facade. It's probably one of the biggest they've had in that spot, so that's really cool. Ooh, look at these new, these little tank tops. Purge masks. They have some really cool Walking Dead merchandise, which is interesting. It's nice to see them change that up. So I think that's going to do it for today. Um, not really much to see this week. Uh, they are starting to cover a lot of the mazes up, so it's going to be harder and harder every single week to see what's new. And that dang tram needs to go in the metro set area. I really want to get those shots. So we'll try next week, but until then, Thanks for watching, guys. I really appreciate it, and I'll see you guys next time in the parks. Bye.